I joined Huawei at 2008. After that, I went to India. I also have worked in Belarus for four months. My longest assignment is Indonesia. So I love this place. I joined the Indonesia office at 2010. So almost 12 years. Time flies so fast. Last year, October, and we have worked together with Bhakti and Cominfo to announce the Bhakti Wusu first site on air. This is my third time with the Babua. I have ever visited Manawari and Sunru. So when I landed, I was surprised. There are so many people, so many local villagers and the kids. But they don't have any signal covered in that island. The people, if they want to make a phone call, they have to across the sea. Takes one and a half hours to find the place. I think the first thing is the BTS, our program, bring signal to the society. Nature have given Babua a very beautiful landscape, but also it's also set up lots of difficulties and obstacles for Babua area. The weather, the route, and the circumstance in this very remote area, Babua, it is big issues. At this morning, we start from Biak at six o'clock. After five hours long journey, we finally arrive this district. We plan to go to the island, okay. And we would like to know, uh, do you have boat from here to this island? May I know how long it takes from here to the island? Please show us your boat. Bisa tunjukin bootmu yang mana? Antrin aja kita. Where is it? It's ruining our plan today. However, it's happening all the time in Indonesia. So this is the obstacle for our inspection. And we really need to care about our teamwork safety. So we have very strict and strong regulations that in the rain weather, all the work cannot perform. The progress stop. That worries me. And we may need to put another or more additional effort to catch up. The 4G mobile uh, internet is one of the most suitable technology for this rural area. Compared with the fixed network, 4G mobile internet is much cheaper in terms of the uh, equipment, in terms of the service, and also, the handset, the mobile handset, is quite popular, common. In Indonesia rural areas, not all the villages have concerned power supply. We implement the solar energy for most of the site to reduce the dependency on the power supply. As you know that this project, uh, why we have applied the material, to our consortium and our consortium Melita Sata, they integrate the material and then dispatch. I have quite a whole team who work together with the Melita Sata team. Actually, we have a joint project organization. We discuss how to speed up the process, how to progress. This is a joint effort, joint effort from all the parties. And as you remember, when the first call was done, uh, my team called me on the site. And beside him, there is one local 
lady. He also smiled, he talked, he, he told us, thanks Huawei. They finally got a signal, they can communicate with the guy outside their hometown. Yeah. I was surprised, I was impressed. I was so impressed by the villagers and by the kids, so many kids. I see that is the future. We need to reduce the digital divide for the future, for the kids. I think we need to do more for them, for their education and for their development. <laughs>